Oh, hey everybody, I'm Blitz, and this right here, he's my very best friend in the entire world. His name is Kevin. Everybody say hi to Kevin. He's so excited for you to be here. Now he does have two jobs for you. The first one is to hit the button, the like button. And if you don't hit that, bad things will start to happen. Bad things. Uh-oh, I said bad things when I really need this one. Yeah, bad things will start happening. Yep, poor Kevin. His life essence will be sucked out of him into a giant pile of Kool-Aid. That's what happens if you don't hit like. And if you haven't already, you have to hit that button on the other side. This one, right over here. This button right over here. Kevin says, please, please hit that button before this thing turns on. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Oh, Kevin. He didn't handle that very well. Please hit like and subscribe. And I'd like to thank a game called Cartel Tycoon for sponsoring this video. As the name implies, it's a brand new business simulation game set in the 1980s narco trade. The game is available on Steam as an early access title with a very unique setting and lots of cool mechanics, great visuals, and a groovy soundtrack that was recorded by Cumbia artists from all over the world. As you play through the game, you build an empire of drug production and smuggling chains while managing rival cartels, rogue lieutenants, government agencies, and of course, the public opinion. And if things do go wrong for you and your capo, and he dies, it's not the end. You can choose the lieutenant that becomes the boss to continue your dynasty. So as you build up your dynasty, you start making a lot of money, and you need to get rid of it. So you need to set up money laundering pipelines to turn your dirty money into nice, clean cash. Right now, there are two different game modes that you can play. You can explore the games in game storyline of your drug empire or you can build an endless empire in the game's sandbox and if you are wondering survival and multiplayer game modes are both planned features for the full development uh, release is planned somewhere around the third quarter of 2021 so if you'd like to become a drug kingpin and build your very own empire set in the 1980s narco trade make sure you click on that link down below in the video description to download cartel tycoon and the soundtrack today in steam's early access now we're just gonna have to clean up the mess of kevin's laying everywhere so we can get on with this video Oh no! <laughs> Follow. And. Kevin? Go! Oh no! <laughs> oh, that was exciting. It's too bad. I really like this thing. Here, do it again. Whoop! Give me this. And we'll just kind of pick it up. And we'll, we'll just kind of yeet it over there. And maybe eventually it'll find its way back into cleaning up <laughs> that car. I need to. Hold up. For just for science purposes, we need to do something a little bit different here. All right, Kevins, let's have some fun. Seems like it's going really fast. Oh, 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 we made it, made it. Oh, they're still alive. How does that work? They just got hit with a bulletproof sheet. Should I test it? I kind of want to test it. Testing times, testing. If only there was like a giant gun in this game. Oh yeah, that, uh, that sheet is totally bulletproof. That car is 100% fine and well, Kevin and his friends leaked out all their Kool-Aid. So I did find some very interesting things on the Steam Workshop. There was a recent update, so let's see if these things still work. Oh, it still works. Oh, that's fantastic looking. It has a bunch of controls here too. It's supposed to be able to fly, so that's exciting. Uh, up and down, open mouth. All right, no retract less. I don't know what that means, so up. Up, oh, whoop, 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 whoop. oh. Oh, 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 it's working. It's working. Mouth open. Um, nom, nom, nom. Oh, that's amazing. How do I make it go forward? Please, quick, tell me. I to go forward. I, you, I. Okay. Uh huh. There's a fire. It shoots fire too. Okay, you. Oh, there's like rockets on there. Get ready. I. Oh, oh, yes. Okay, turn off. Turn off. We just need a little bit of forward motion. Oh, that's so cool. Burn. Burn. Uh oh. Oh, I shot rockets out of it. Okay, we can't be going up if we're shooting things. Let's go down quick. Down, down, open your mouth, open your mouth, and fire! Oh, that's so sick! What a cool contraction. It's a little bit hard. We better follow it. If I do that, it should be easier. Yes! Uh oh, up, 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 up. Oh, ground hits hard. That's okay. We can still fire things. No, we can't. It's broken. <laughs> they crashed it. It's still trying to work a little bit. <laughs> it's got some problems though. Oh, that is so cool looking. So these are all lights in it. That's amazing. Well, that works pretty well. Like, I mean, I crashed it. It tries to get off the ground. Doesn't work too well. I mean, not anymore. Look at the tail still up in there. What a neat build. I should probably clean it up by now. Sometime, maybe in the future. Come on, hurry up, car. <laughs> Push it out of the way, dude. Oh, this car doesn't work too well. Wait. 
<laughs> but you make it so much bigger. See, I'll show you what a regular size car looks like. Yeah, like this. And then I just made it bigger. Maybe we should use a tank. Quick, tanky boy, get it out of the way. We'll bring in some trucks to clean up. All right, those, are, those aren't trucks. We'll bring in some trucks, like I said. Maybe eventually we can get it to clean up. <laughs> the tank's working. Go, buddy, go. Yes, it's leaving it in the air. Come on, it just needed a boost. Take me to your people. Okay, no joke. We need to nuke it. Boom! Oh, 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 that was fun. Nuking things in this game is my favorite. I'm seriously convinced that every single game ever made needs to have a nuke Easter egg in it. Like, why not, right? It needs it. You get bored playing Call of Duty? Yeah, call in that nuclear tactical nuke. Uh-huh. Just got a nuke boost with your friends. Playing Super Mario Odyssey? Why not use a nuke and destroy every Koopa on the map? I mean... Fortnite couldn't get any worse, so you could add nukes to it to make it fun at least. And Minecraft has plenty of mods that add nukes to the game. I've tested most of them. So I might have found this thing too. It looks pretty cool. I don't know if it works because of that update, but oh, it does work. Oh, that's amazing. Look, it's walking. Haha. <laughs> uh, and then boom. Ooh. You know what we should do? I mean, in celebration of Godzilla versus Kong, we should bring in Giganto Cog Cogzilla. Cog. Well. Bowling ball Zilla. <laughs> uh, buddy, can you be my friend? Oh, he's standing up. There he goes. Nice. We have two giant walkers here. Oh, boy. Quick fire. Oh, it's... You got a little... Whoa! <laughs> That's amazing. Pew! Oh, those those bullets, those rockets are cool. Um, giant Godzilla bro doesn't like us here. What does this say? Oh, W. Oh, W brings in fires and stuff? Let's see. Oh! No, that's lasers. Okay. Oh, Godzilla's nuking our, our truck. Oh, man, this is terrible. Fire all the missiles. Good thing it doesn't quite burn. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, no. <laughs> that poor guy that was up there. He's almost going to be a bad off here is Kevin. Here, you need a cower just for fun. There you go. Oh, oh, he's going to get crushed. Oh, and ugh. <laughs> oh, he's squeaking away. He's gonna make it. Kevin's gonna survive. <laughs> this is the slowest death ever. Uh oh. <laughs> Whoop. <laughs> he's like a an inchworm, like a caterpillar. Oh, that might hurt. He'll be okay. It, oh, he's not gonna be okay. Those legs might break off. It's okay. They're not real legs. They're uh, crash test dummy legs because Kevin's not real. Why are you still making noise back here? Seriously, Godzilla, stop. We're trying to defeat you, but you already broke our truck shoot you in the chest. So evidently our walker can't really crush things. <laughs> he knocked him out and it just keeps pushing him forward. Eventually Godzilla is just gonna come down and just chomp him. Ha! Crunch. Oh, do the barrel roll. That was pretty cool. Look, he can stand on his tail. Wait, is this tail like a sword? A big S word? No, Godzilla, stop. I need to play with your tail. Just give me your tail. I wanna see what it does. Oh yeah, totally. Here, we don't need this anymore. Boop, boop. I got a new tail. Hey, come back here. Kevin needs this for science purposes. Okay, that deleted him. I think I figured out why I don't have any action figures left from my childhood. Oh, whoa, whoa. That might be, oh, that's a laser fired missile. Uh oh, no, 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 no. Oh, yep, that's why I don't have any action figures. That thing's cool. Ow, that was a big drop. We can't drop you so far. That is a terrible spot. Drive. All right, we'll try it. Fire! Whoa! <laughs> um, pause. Rotate. There you go. There, nope, 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 nope. Rotate! Oh! <laughs> Yay! That's cool. I like that thing. We gotta play with that more. If we have two driving towards each other, will it work? Okay, we got one there and one there. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, that was pretty cool. Pew, pew. Go, missiles, go! Uh-oh. Uh oh. Oh! Oh! Why did they hit themselves? Oh, that was amazing. Do it again. More. Fire more projectiles. Ha <laughs> They're coming back down. And then you fire this way. Why are you coming back down at your creator? Uh oh. Oh! They're just blowing up into pieces. Oh! I like this. I need like 17 of them. Uh oh. Whoops. Beep, 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 beep. Beep, 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 beep. I wonder if they're all trying to work off of the same laser pointer. It might be. But I think the real question is this. Can we defeat King Kong? 
using it. Well, hmm, you need a turn, bud. We'll do some advanced targeting systems. It's working. It's working. Quick, we should aim for the. Well, we'll just aim for the chest. Oh! Oh, you went over it. Okay, it's coming back. No, oh, nice. King Kong jumps in there. He doesn't like that very much. Oh, buddy, sit. Sit down. Sit. Why are you being dumb right now? Fine, do I have to do this the manual way? There. It's kind of broken. We did it. We kind of did it. Try again. Fires and missiles. Oh, a headshot. Wait, what? Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> I don't know what that's doing. Okay. Why are they just... Why is the, Why are they being sucked into his brain? King Kong. He's stealing all my missiles. Oh, there we go. There we go. Fire. Oh, no. Oh, no. We broke it. Oh, that's cool. It's digging down deep into his heart. What? It came out his front. <laughs> that's amazing. I need one of these in real life. Whoa. Okay. No, 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 no. Oh, missiles. Go in. That's kind of cool. They're like... Needle missiles. Did you have to break our truck? Oh, no, 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 don't. It's, it'll be okay. I promise. We'll just, uh, we'll just duct tape it together real good. You know, just slap that duct tape right on. It'll be perfect, I promise. Nothing's gonna get broken ever again in my, my watch. Yes! <laughs> oh, no! Kong! Did we knock him out? His lights are off. Woo! A double shot! Nice! Right in the head. We're doing it! We're doing it! We're blowing him up! I think we did it! I think we defeated King Kong! Quick! Fire another one! Maybe- Oh! Oh! What's going on? Why is he breakdancing? Uh-oh. He's born breakdancing. He straight up broke. A couple more breaking like that. We could break the game. I feel like we need to crash the game. That's always exciting. I wonder if we can crash the game with two Kongs fighting it out. Like, you have to pretend they're fighting. But then one of them will hit the self-destruct nuke and both of them will explode into like a bajillion pieces. Ooh. Oh, that was sick. It didn't, they didn't really go spaghetti mode like I had hoped. I feel like I can remedy that with a couple more nukes. One on the bottom, one on the top. Boom! Okay, that one kind of spaghettified now. But it's still not broken the game. But I have a good feeling this will. Uh-oh. Okay, ooh, yes. It's like 4th of July fireworks. And I did it, yay, go team, I broke the game. So I might've found one of the most complicated machines that I've ever found in this game. And somebody on the Steam Workshop did an amazing job on this thing. It's a straight up jet plane with a detractable missile that it fires. I mean, look at that. That is so stinking cool. I got it in slow motion because it's really difficult to fly. Uh, no joke. And you can actually control the missile too. Like, it's nosing up a little bit, nosing down. How cool is that? If I go back into full mode, like, yeah, that thing is so fast. They're gonna go, yeah. <laughs> and then, I mean, the plane is super hard to control too. Oh, pull up, pull up, pull up. Yes, yes, it's working. Go down, 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 down. Whoop, not down, down. Oh, there's the wall. Uh, well, I mean, it's it didn't blow up. So let's uh, retract the landing gear. That's a good idea. So since it's on kind of common theme in this video, I want to try to hit Godzilla. Oh, he's so big. Maybe we should move you back on the map. Yeah, we'll move you to like here. There, that'll be cool. And then you're going to hit the ground. And it's going to hurt. So I'll just put you down normally. There you go. Who is a good dinosaur mutant thing? That didn't actually work. Don't turn that way. Turn this way. There you go, bud. Yeah. All right. And then I will get the airplane in. The AIM-9. I'm guessing it's a Swedish jet plane. So we'll spawn that in. Yep, good, okay. And then it needs to fly for a little bit. And then we're gonna launch the missile. The missile is launched, the missile did not go off. There's so much stuff happening here. Okay, fire the missile. Please work this time. All right, let's see if we can do it this time. Uh-huh, L, what does L do? L is the landing gear, obviously. Nice! And then there is a there is a gun in the front. Dun, dun. Okay, that, that's not as cool as actually launching a real missile. There we go! The missile is launched. We're gonna pull up now. Pull up. No, not not the camera up. Pull up. Pull up. The missile's going. The jet is starting to pull up. Now we need to control. We're gonna control the missile. Uh-huh. Might work. It actually looks like it's targeting Godzilla's brain. Nice! We called in the military and destroyed Godzilla. Come on. Come on. Oh, there it is. There it is. Yes! Yes! Oh, that's so cool! Ready? Get set and boom! Oh! Oh! 
There it goes, it blew up. I didn't even have to do that. Oh, that was amazing. That was such a cool shot. And where's the airplane at? It's still going. Oh, that's awesome. I did it. I'm so impressed with myself. I succeeded once in life. The only problem is it wasn't a nuke. Like that could have been better if it was a nuke, but I mean, detonating a missile inside Godzilla's head, that'd have to kill him, right? So there is one more thing. In the last update, they did release a new secret achievement. Um, it's pretty cool. I haven't actually done it yet, so I wanna try to get it. It kind of showed you a little bit. So it's it's time, time to use smarts now. If we go to the tower, and there's a lot of smart people on the Discord server that figured this out and on the Steam forums and everything like that. So if we put in a TV, obviously, because televisions are the way of the future, television down here, because television killed the radio star or something, we activate this, weird stuff happens. I mean, People Playground is a weird game anyway, but check this out, we have a circle and its radius is one. Okay, and then it does another circle around the circle. So we have two circles with radius of what? I don't I don't really understand. Anyway, we we know we get that knowledge and then we go to the abyss map. Uh-huh, like right over here, the abyss. All right, so we got the abyss map here, right? And if we come down here into this corner, we saw this before. It's a little a little thing. Uh-oh. I messed it up. <laughs> Whoops. As I was saying, uh, everybody knows that two or pi times the diameter is uh, the circumference because it showed that circle going around. That's the circumference. So if we put in the circumference of or the radius of one is diameter of two and the circumference of two times pi, which I mean, I here's something nerdy. I'll, I'll be OK. Here we go. In seventh grade, I memorized pi to 50 digits. I'm not joking either. It's I'm I'm a little I'm a little bit ashamed of that. So if I put in two times pi here, I get what is it? So pi is three point one four one five nine two six five three five eight nine seven nine three two three four six two six four three three eight three two seven nine. You can look it up. I memorized it. Anyway, six two eight three one eight five three zero oh, seven one seven nine five approximately and then we get this that says module2.jpg cool right and if i open up the steam files i get this thing called modulo2.jpg uh-huh and then i can open it and ta-da it's broken so i don't know <laughs> maybe a red herring or something but um, there does seem to be something else tied to it. So if I bring in Kevin here, he's gonna be our mad scientist. We need to put a hat down him. What kind of hat does he want? Push button, that looks good. We'll just uh, disable the collision, make it a little bit smaller, and we'll duct tape it to his face. Beautiful. It's great. You're supposed to not be so big. Sure, Kevin's got a hat, he likes it. There, <laughs> perfect, Kevin has a hat. He also has a vacuum, which doesn't, it's not really a vacuum but I pretend it is because he likes vacuuming things. Uh-oh, um, just, it went rogue on him. <laughs> He'll be all right. But no, Kevin has a plan. He has a very nice plan. First off, he needs a plank because he just likes wood. Wood is very nice, isn't it, Kevin? And then he needs one of these things. I don't even know what they're called. What is it called? Rotor. And we need to set the rotor for motor speed of 8,000. Apply that. Cool, that should work out nicely. We'll put that there, freeze that in place, and if we turn it on, it kind of goes circles really, really fast. So if you make a dampening box over here, I said over here, not down below, and we hook it up with duct tape right like that, then that should spin around in circles, right? Uh-huh, see how that works? Nice and fast, beautiful. Then Kevin's gonna walk over here, he's gonna jump on this thing. Stand, stand up, Kevin. Kevin, stand up, he did it. I'm actually kind of surprised. I'm impressed with him today. Now is where the fun begins. We'll put one of these here, just like that. We're gonna freeze this into position. We're gonna hook up this with a wire, just like that. Uh-huh. Work. Uh-oh. You know, on second thought, let's just remove these and then we'll do it again the right way. Rotor. Dampening box. Wire. Fixed cable. Rotor speed. 8,000. Apply. And then we get to put in three of these things. These are the mirrors. And I'm gonna set the angle to 45 degrees, 45 degrees and 135. That's not a three and a five degrees. Nice. I bet you can know where this is going, don't you? 
If we do that, we come over here. You guys have no idea why I'm doing this right now, but I will show you very shortly. Freeze that, freeze, nope, those are frozen. And then we will move this approximately right here. Turn that on just to make sure it works. Not quite right. We'll get it back in this square position. Good. Now, Kevin, I need you to sit down for just a second. There you go, bud. And I mean, you might as well lay down, right? I think this will do the trick. No, Kevin, lay down. <laughs> Good boy. So after a little bit of trial and error and a few slight problems, I finally got it working. And activate. <laughs> Get out of here, Kevin. But look, we are summoning it. Maybe. Oh, it might not work because Kevin was on it. <gasps> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Here. Let's delete that one. We'll get a brand new one plank. Brand new plank in here. Without Kevin powered. We'll put that down right there. Freeze that into place. And... Hmm. Something's kind of off. Oh, it's slowing down a little bit, isn't it? What happens if I do this? No, it doesn't work either. Uh-oh. Yeah, it's not working. <laughs> it looks fun, though. So if I did this right... All I have to do is hit this button right here and then it should start working. I don't know what it's doing, but it's kind of cool. There's kind of exciting things happening. Go, 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 go. What's it doing? What's it going to do? Um, I feel like I need to sacrifice somebody real quick. Hey, oh, okay. I really don't want to interrupt that stream though, because it could do something quite interesting. Um, um. Oh! Okay, then. <laughs> wow. Hello there. What is this? I found a new toy. <laughs> no better way to... Whoa! It's a gun. Okay, ready? And you get put in here. And then... Bow! Okay, then. It's not as deadly as I thought it was. I mean, it is pretty... Pretty scurry. Slow motion. Boom! Oh. Wait, where'd the... Where'd the projectile go? Oh, so some projectiles went. Oh, okay. That thing goes really stupidly fast. And pow. Oh, I saw it that time. Yes. So I just created a teleport and I teleported this and it was cool. And front facing Kevin. Um, oh, that was the wrong spot. <laughs> He's like, what's going on, fellas? I'm a little bit scared of him. He, he haunts my dreams sometimes. It's like, hey, Blitz, how are you doing again? Let me eat your kidney. I was like, what? Doesn't even make sense, bro. All right. And front facing Kevin gets. Oh. Just like dead. <laughs> okay. We totally need to summon in Godzilla. Yep. Just like this. Godzilla! And then I have to use the gun that I. Oh, there's. Excuse me. You're not allowed in there. <laughs> nope. Neither are you. Like, it's fine. We don't need that in, in there. It causes backfires and stuff. All right, let's freeze this in a place. We got to put on a laser sight. We'll just put that there and then we'll duct tape it in a place. Yes, that'll be perfect. And now we know exactly kind of where we're shooting at. And boom. Godzilla. <laughs> where are you going, Godzilla? Where are you going, bro? Come back here. It's time for you to make your meet, make your end, get ended and stuff. However that saying goes. Uh -huh, right, in the, right in the brain. And... Boop, 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 boop. There it is. There it is. <laughs> that's cool. What an interesting game, man. What a strange game. So that's the end of the video. Thanks again to Cartel Tycoon for sponsoring this one. If you guys do want to go check out that game, <laughs> make sure you go ahead and click on that link down below in the video description and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. Bye. <laughs> And I'd like to thank everyone who signed up on Patreon, including Ben, Ellen Hagen, Dickie James, Apollo Bunny, Otto Dave, Eagle Arc, Whip It Good, Seraphin X, Des Bogger, Maxer, Sarnoff, Legacy, Jason McFarland, Deacon, Paul Longstone, and Ralph. And everyone who has clicked that join button down below to become a YouTube channel member. 